Alright, welcome to Eve Singularity. I'm Major Freak. I'll make this quick. I'm going to make two tests. Uh, one at my original current fittings for my Astras, and the other one will whip over to uh, Mark II, which I'd set up, ironically enough, last week, and I didn't think I'd need. But uh, I think I should really rip out one of the rigs and put in Mark II for uh, Zero Days. Um, the one that's going to be hit uh, by uh, domain research and mining. I'd be fascinated to see the uh, the efficacy efficacy of it. Uh, that's for sure. So uh, I'll show you how long it takes to target. Forty one seconds. Also takes twenty six seconds to target to track it back. Now we have. Give me a sec here. Now we have light missiles. We'll go for the, uh, the Guardian. We'll use the heavy missiles on the Drekabak. We won't bother with using fighters. Um, you can break using uh, fur bogs and all that stuff uh, and heavy missiles a uh, Drekabak quite quickly. And you can, you can also kill uh, kind of uh, a Guardian using light missiles. Uh, it takes longer. Uh, the damage is anemic, really. I'll show you. So this Guardian is going full burn around uh, their uh, target. Now, of course, I would recommend not doing this because it really doesn't work. Uh, I'd recommend you have um, auto repeat off and just target a bunch of all the Lodgy and just cycle through them. You know, just keep, just keep breaking their locks, breaking their locks, just keep cycling and constantly breaking their locks and, and it will multiply the efforts. It will also, because you're not having it active all the time, increase your duration of your cap. So that this is the uh, damage you're going to be doing against a guardian going full burn. Okay. Um, you can ramp that up quite significantly up to 75, I believe, if it stopped. Um, we shall turn off its afterburner, and I'll show you it'll it'll ramp up quite significantly, but not a factor of 10. It's just double. So at some point it will hit 50. At about 250, there we go, 300. It'll hit 50, and at half speed and less well wait a minute uh, at 200 at 200 it will hit so 300 it'll hit 50 at 200 it'll hit 75 and, and even if you're stopped so anywhere between um, 0 and 250 or 200 sorry it'll do full damage and if you're going just above that you're going to be in 50 and if you're doing full, over 300, it'll do even less. So yeah, just fine. So we'll turn off that before I go gaboom. And as you can see, it it's it's not exactly doing great against the Guardian, even without reps coming in. So yeah. So that is that. And while that's happening, I will wrap you back to full health, and let's try the Drekabak. So the Drekabak, we switch to heavy missiles. And I'll show you the damage real quick, and then we'll switch almost immediately to the other one. Alright, here we go. So this one's not using micro warp drive. I believe I, if I use micro warp drive, I can plug in crews and really do heavy damage to it. So it wouldn't be so smart to do that. So we'll get about, okay, there we go, 255. Okay. So 255 is pretty much what we're looking at for damage, 250. Um, if we're going slower, by a certain percentage. Um, whoops, sorry. Bring that out. Uh, there we go. Um, 
if we slow down, it would be even greater damage coming in. You know? So I'll get Rantaniel to do some ripping quickly. So we can show you the damage here. So yeah, it ramps up quite significantly the damage um, once you start slowing down and of course it would be just like before. So yeah. So yeah, pretty heavy damage. And you can you can pretty much gank this quite quickly as you can see much faster than you can um, the guardian. So yeah, heavy missiles just brutalize it. So that is that. Bring up our overview. one quickly Yeah, they don't last long without uh, incoming energy transfers, that's for sure. All right. Okay, here we go. And the lock time is uh, will be significantly faster. I'll, uh, I'll do rain first. Watch this speed. Oops. Taking your time, aren't you? Come on, get get the hell out there. seconds so yeah cycling your targets and of course when you get this kind of um, setup it's quite amazing the uh, the number of targets you can select is pretty huge maximum mark you get nine you can have nine so it's, it's more than enough and since we're we've got auto repeat off we can absolutely and once you load the proper script it's perma jam so you know no matter overheating eccm doesn't matter so they're they're better off uh scan resolution that's why i've got it loaded on the guardian because playing smart not dumb okay so the target painter is freaking amazing so let's see the damage with light missiles just with this stuff through the shield, blah blah yada yada. So it's going full burn and it was doing about 30, 35 damage, 33 damage. Before on mark one at full burn. So 31, yeah, same. So good, that's good. So now we'll we'll apply the target painter. So it uh, does significantly increase damage, uh, which is amazing, actually. And watch uh, 
Watch this. So if we're not using Afterburner. So let's see, 62, and let's go to 300. Let's see what happens at 300. 72, 78, 300 is 86. And... So 200, 100 I mean, and going below 200 will give no increase, okay, let's go down further, it's going to be definitely a threshold somewhere, right, oh, we better speed this up, <laughs> so I'm getting 102, 102, 101, okay, fair enough. Get some reps down quick and cut the damage. Heavy missiles this time. Now we'll try heavy missiles on uh, rain and get her back up to speed. heavy missiles this time. With, of course, a target painter. Now, we were doing 31 per hit on armor. So, look at that, eh? 61, so double. You, yeah, you're, so you're effectively doubling it. Yeah. So, yeah, heavy missiles for sure. Uh, once you get targeted, and it's it's amazing, isn't it? Um, the the assistance that one target painter does to, and it's permanent too, so it's it's just great. Um, that's why I, I um, yeah, I really recommend. It. I mean, and if you're cycling targets, you don't need three. You can drop down to two, and you just break those locks, break those locks, break those locks. Keep 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 them frustrated. Keep them pressuring their micro. Just push it, push it, push it. So yeah. Alright, so we'll switch to heavy on this and we'll reload all. And we'll just whittle away the shields on this one. So 240. All right. Now we turn on the target painter. So yeah, 50% more. Pretty nice, huh? Now watch this. Target painter. Let's see the... Uh, let's see the cruise. Yeah, my capital drain, but I don't care. Alright, so here we go, here's the cruise. So typically you'd be doing less damage with cruise. Um in a normal situation without the target painter, I test it. And I should shouldn't be really getting more but it'd be nice if we did. So okay, no. Yeah, so definitely not. So yeah, heavy missiles for sure still. And it just increases the damage by uh, fifty percent for that. And yeah, quite significant for the heavy missiles. So yeah, heavy missiles and target painter. You can't go wrong. Um, totally recommend it. Um, the nuding, um, you can pressure uh, a Dracovax Newt with one, but you can really go to town if you land both, and which means one less Dracovax to target. So you're really pressuring it, and then if you have two reps uh, from each Drekovac, you got 
two Draco Acts applying two reps, you can do you can still do a significant amount of damage to it. Watch this. Um, well, it's capped out, so I won't bother. But uh, yeah, the the effect is is you can do damage to a Dracovac quite significantly if they've got four Dracovacs on field. You're shooting one, needing one, and they've got two that can reliably uh, rep the other Dracovac being shot, and you can still do damage. Uh, any more than that, yeah, it gets a bit dicey, and of course you've got the Guardians to uh, cycle your targets on, but yeah, I mean seriously this uh the yeah you can you can seriously do some uh some big time damage and yeah the target painter for 50 percent more damage who wouldn't say yes to that if they could and of course if you don't have these on all the time absolutely go down to two and just cycle those targets cycle those targets break those locks pressure the micro what else are you gonna do right all right